the energy vibration reading for the Leo Sun Moon Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful support, likes, and share. This is the first week of December. The weekends from the third until the night. I want to say thank you so much for your help. Um, and please like, share these videos. Um, don't forget to cross watch and listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign. The week is water, and the zodiac energy is fire. Let's see what's happening for you, Leos. I'm seeing us working together. You want to work together with someone to bring some balance. Um, there's a transition that is going to be coming there. Listen to your intuition about this transition. Two major arcana beside each other is saying a lot. There is a situation with the King of um, the King of Cups, and some of you are dealing with um, a situation with the Knight of Cups, and this is a family situation. So some of you could have a child or a partner and um, an organization. All right, let's get um, it is the wheel of fortune so it is um, the zodiac energy of your sister um, the Sagittarians who are having birthday wheel of fortune is coming here it is also your energy vibration so it's gonna be a, um, a positive week because I'm seeing a transition coming in here for you guys so some of you are working together or some of you could be working together with an um, Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, and there is going to be a transition an healing that is coming up for a family situation um, here you are having the energy of the eye princess that is here um, with an organization organization okay whatever the situation is whatever that is transpiring it has to do with the king of um, cups so we're going to be looking so a lot of you um, have a situation with the men between the ages of 15 and 45 15 and 45 and older okay listen to your intuition about the king of cups whatever is there and our organization listen to your intuition okay let's see what is to inspire we have the energy of the two of um, Pentacles which some of you are trying to bring balance either to your financial work or bring balance to a relationship it could be a relationship with your kid or a relationship with your partner there's going to be changes that is coming in with the financial security of the family and the energy of the eye princess okay so I'm seeing some conflicts that is coming in with the five of one some conflicts that is coming in it could be conflicts with the kids at home but it also could be conflicts with your partner so let's see what's the eye princess and the, the, the debt um, you are going to be leaving the situation behind you're thinking about leaving a situation behind that no longer serves you okay so there's a conflict and the the debt is coming in to bring a transition a transition in your life okay then we have um, the um, the hangman seeing the truth of the situation um, finally some of you are seeing the truth of the situation if some of you were dealing with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion you're seeing the truth of the situation with him okay um, whatever it is um, it could be that you were thinking oh the sky is so weird what is happening um, or this man is so weird or is your husband something is going on yes it is okay don't double guess yourself um, um the king of cups the the knight of cups is a pisces cancer scorpion between the ages of mm, 15 and 45 he's very sad he's sad about a family situation it's very sad very sad about a family situation and it's okay he said about family situation whatever has transpired he said um, he said about his father an organization
Okay. All right. Obviously, something is coming up here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's a sad week. I'm receiving some sadness, but for the rest, is it good? But this Knight of Cups is. Uh, some of you are trying to work out the situation with this Knight of Cups, but he's so sad. There's so many conflicts. There's so many decisions. There's so many things that is happening. Really. Yeah. And he's sad over the King of Pentacles. It could be his father, because I'm seeing the Queen of Pentacles there. Also, a karmatic situation. And... You know, he's sad, be there for him. Some luck is going to be coming out, okay? Some luck is going to be coming out. And, you know, um, some luck is going to be coming out for him. He's going to be okay. He's going to be okay. Some luck is going to be coming out for him. It's going to be okay. All right? it's going to be okay so if some of you are having some situation with your kids okay because I'm seeing whoever this person is there is sadness sadness over sadness over this situation okay it is a family situation there is some sadness. This child has great sadness that he's carrying. Oh, okay. All right. Some great sadness. But it is, it's, there is something. Um, his mom is going to make sure that he's okay. Um, whatever the situation is, his mom is going to make sure that he's okay. There's going to be some conflicts in the organization. Okay, all right. So, um, hmm, there's going to be a, um, some conflicts. Okay, in an organization, we have um, here the energy of the King of Cups. Um, the King of Cups is going to be having some conflicts with an organization. Okay, and it has to do with the King of um, Pentacles. Now. Um, some of you could be dealing with this person. Some of you could have a kid with either a Pisces, uh, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person, or whether a man or a woman. Um, and you have a kid that is a uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. There, there are some things going on with this child. It doesn't really. There are some conflicts. There's a whole lot of things. He is sad. And it has to do with the father and the organization. So, whatever that is transpiring, okay, whatever that is transpiring, it doesn't have to be his father. Um, this man could be coming up as an older man and a work situation, because here it's an organization. Okay, so, hmm six of swords as an end I have family situation and the father there's some sadness there is some sadness oh so whatever is going on some of you could be married to the Star Wars Virgo or Capricorn man and there is there is um moving away moving on there's a transition there is moving away there's moving on there is a transition this man has a connection because here we have the energy of uh, um the eye princess and organization so 
um, there was you were right about a situation you were really really right about a situation or organization and I think there is some conflicts with the organization and it's as if this um, someone is trying to help someone is trying to help this person is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion man you had seen a, a situation and some of you could have had this man is a psychic because some of you could have had contact connection with this person whoever this person is and you have a feeling about this person that he's psychic or they do something or whatever it is and you were right because this man is having a conflict with the organization because of this night of Pentacles so um, it's as if this man knows something that is happening okay but some luck is going to come for the child and that's the most important thing because he's so sad he is so sad some luck is going to be coming in for him because he's just so sad whatever that is happening whatever that is transpiring he is um, just so sad but some luck is uh, going to be coming in the all that is happening in this week is a karmatic situation here you have the wheel of fortune some of you could be connecting with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and this person is going to be helping you um, to build your financial stability okay this person is going to be helping you to build your financial stability whatever it's going on okay and for the people who are worried about the kids uh, about what is going to be happening for their kids it's going to be okay some luck is going to be coming in because here you have the kids here um, it's all about the kids in this week okay some luck is going to be coming in it could be also um, someone's partner but it's it could be also someone's partner but it's a situation with a kid this could be an older person also because the kids are between the ages of um, 0 and 45 basically so um, here you're seeing but he somehow he's gonna be receiving some luck some help because it could be a friend of yours um, this this person um, is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion we could be having some conflicts with the organization about what has transpired and what has happened okay so um this whatever they're they're looking at or but some luck is going to be coming for this child and this is really wonderful and really good um and let's see what else is coming out i'm using the e the oracle of the e so let's see what is coming out um, time to fly time to fly you Leah's time to fly good things are going to be happening luck is here with a new start there is some conflicts we have the energy of the king of cups an organization that is having some conflicts whatever the situation is it's a time to fly so enjoy fly and do what you want to do ladies and gentlemen um I want to wish you a very wonderful week. Namaste until next time.